I wonder if they're typing glasses for non normal people. Hi! <laughs> We're back. It's Little Nightmares 2. So I throw myself in. You know. Spooky, scary. Skellingtons. Send shippers down your spine. What's going on there? Yeah, so we, we tried to do this last time. I think we. No, we never got out. I guess he didn't save. Hmm. Yes, animation. <laughs> uh, I figured it would save after we got out of the window the last time. Wasn't so hard. Now back where we were. Left the weird uh, bird-eyed lady. Mrs. Teacher Man. But, you know, children are tasty. I don't know. I don't know what you know. Big government tells you, but children are tasty. <laughs> I guess they would tell you right, because everybody knows, right? All, you know, all non-decent government leaders, which is the grand majority. They're all baby eaters. All of them. Every single one of them. So they would tell you that babies taste bad. And you, but then you brand them. Why would somebody who eats babies tell me babies taste bad? And, you know, I would follow that up with, you know, why does an adult, right, like, you know, I saw a meme. You know, I, I, I do peruse the memory from time to time. And there was a meme about a guy trying to trick his kid. And thinking the milkshake tastes bad, so there's more milkshake for him. And that's your answer, right? You know? They tell you babies taste bad. Because they want to eat all the babies. It's all for them. No babies for the common man. It's like, a, it's like the, the fat capitalist meme. With the water in the pipe and the guys dripping, getting one drop, and it's you know, it's of course like something along the lines of like poor Smash players only getting a drop of underage girls. Somebody needs to work on their uh, architecture skills. All the buildings are tilting. That's dangerous. It seems like the foundations of the city would be very well. Well, that said, with a giant ravine in the middle of the city, I'd imagine some of them collapsed into the hole and they're still standing. I like how I have a little coat and a hat, and poor poor six is stuck without him. Oh, sir. Are you? How long has the bus been? Why can't I have the fedora? Can I like get in the suit? Have you done taxes lately? I will admit, this game isn't as horrific as I thought it was going to be. You know, which is a positive for me. I hate horror games. But the last one, I, I think I was a little more spooked. The last one. You know what I mean? I'm not saying bad game or anything. Bad, sh bad show. Bad show. No, but uh, I, mean, I, I, you know, I was thinking that I'm happy. It's not a spooky. Or maybe I've gotten better at spookies. Oh, cool. I doubt it's a ladder. I, I don't think, uh... I think if, you know, I tried to launch up Alien again, it would just be another shit show. 
What are you doing here, buddy? I think we obviously have to close it somehow. But I, I do not know. <sighs> I can't help it. I'm very yawning. Well, actually, I, I didn't get my full sleep time today. Is that the rock? We're going to move that far. It really isn't like bouncing on that thing. It's not. That's not an option. jump off of that. I think you have to get this close somehow, but I don't... I don't understand how one would get it close, you know what I mean? Oh, oh. There's three-dimensional movement. What is the third dimension, Father? I have existed only in two dimensions. Now you tell me there is a third. That is heresy, Father. Heresy. Next you will tell me there are more dimensions like time. Or, uh, pineapple. Yes. A three-dimensional pineapple. How silly might that be? Imagine, Father. It is... But a, a bad man's dream. Son, I, 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 I do not know what to say, son. I'm sorry for the lies. However, it has been a closely guarded secret in our society. The third dimension. The place where the creatures live. The beings. Of time and space that have not one, not two, but three. I don't know. I, I don't know what it is with me. It's always when I start streaming. The body's like, yes. I see that you decided to sit down and play video games now. It is time for bed. And I'm just here, like, what do you mean it's time for bed? Why are you making me yawn so much? Is that like a little rabbit? Come on and play, Georgie. Never watched the. Never watched it. Yeah, I'm not a horror guy. Hey, if I do a jacket. I won't pick it up and show it to you or anything. You, you gotta do it yourself. Self-sufficiency, that's what I that's, you know what I preach. Oh god. This this game was made by British people. It's got colors with a U in it. Oh gee. <laughs> Stop it, for fuck's sake. <laughs> I don't want to sleep. Well, I guess I, you know, I could always sleep, right? You know what I mean? I'm sure that that is a very, uh, as the children would say, hashtag relatable. Fuck you. Uh, hello? 
don't. I'd like to buy a hat, please. You just watch it close the door. I want to make sure nobody knows we were here. And I'll come up on the chair. I wanted to get into the cash register. Money. What if I just do it on this hat? I don't think I can land on top of it now. Now you might. No hats for you. Got a parkour. I like that. Let they put the. Bow ring in. It's very hard to ring, but you know. Uh, anything we can take in here. I'm just looking around for hats. Oh, another one. No longer wet shall you be. Tink tonk. Break my legs. My little baby boy legs. So as uh, the guy said last time, there's obviously a, uh, oh jeez, this is going to be like a nurse section. We have an insane asylum or a hospital. I want to go in there. I can see where you're directing the game. I, I, I know. I know what's in there. Alright, it's going to be some terrifying nurse with uh, really long fingers and she's gonna have just the worst face but I, mean, I can see it now I can just I can see whatever monster monstrous existence is in a uh, gore hospital. This kind of reminds me of the uh, Call of Duty game we played. Yeah, that might pose a little bit of a problem. Well, you know what? Six tested it out first. Meanwhile, you know, parkouring across the entire fucking bed set. My, uh... Slow ass. Just like, oh... I don't know if I make that jump, dog. Who are taking the fucking lead with this shit? On point. Fuck. <laughs> uh. 
Uh, I do love a good, you know. I don't know, I'm not a big fan of it when it's like on a meme, right? So if you know the, uh, like the, uh, marketable plushy meme, for lack of any better. Example. They go, ah! It's like a really loud scream. I don't like loud memes, right? I like my memes to be of a moderate volume. And, uh, if, you know, if they have to get loud. You get to a reasonable level. It's not like, you know, ear rape. Button. Anything at that door? Remember, once you get to the bottom, you gotta jump. Oh, that's, that was just death. So we actually have to figure out whatever we gotta do. Okay. Or. No. Six doesn't respond instantly. Mm hmm. I'm not just sure what to do there. Let's just try it, right? I, I doubt this is going to be the solution, but let's just see what's over here when I don't. I thought maybe the, uh... Wow. There we go. Just the smash a bottle for good luck. You say, uh... Opa! Right, like in a restaurant? Because all restaurants are Jewish for some reason. Wait, that's a Jewish thing, right? It's because, like, oh, you know, I bet you it's because, like, um... I think it's Jewish weddings where they, like, they get the... They smashed a glass cup or something. I'm trying to push her. I don't. I don't understand what she's doing. I thought maybe you had to grab onto like the, the uh, elevator's like tether. Imagine it just smashed. And we were stuck here forever. Wouldn't that be fun? What's better than eternal imprisonment? Eternal, external, upternal, downternal. How many turtles could you ask for? Because, like, nothing opens up, right? So, got a little bit, you know, just a little bit dummy dumb. But it worked out, you know? After a number of unnecessary deaths.
Fuck all, they've gone full dodge tilt again. Hey, look what I found. Can I see it? Can you fucking help me here? Yeah, I'm not a big fan of this so far. So we go for the wheelchair. I wonder if I missed any of those. I think I probably missed some stuff at this point, but it's, you know, it's fine. It's okay. Anybody want a piss jug? Talk about a game isn't scary. And of course, this shit like this too. Also, this game is surprisingly old. I didn't realize it came out in like 2017. Mm, that kind of feels like the right way. I wonder if I was gonna go out or if it's just, you know. He's just doing that for atmospheric effects, I wonder. I wonder. Part of me doesn't wanna find out. breathing. I don't know what's happening with some of these throws. Something, something weird, weird might come out and there'd be an achievement for it, but nope, just uh, it's about wasting all the sodas. Zero, 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 two, four, nine. Now serving zero, 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 two, four, nine. Look down, you're number six. They missed you, obviously. You were in the bathroom for like five minutes. No. Oh, so it's not even a... Oh, I thought... Oh, they're not even people. They're just, like, puppets.
Alright, I'm just sure to do this. Closer to the door. There's these things walking around in there. So I need two fuses for that upstairs bit. Possibly. I think I got cancer now. <laughs> oh, fuck this. Right, so like, you know. So, um, you know, I know basic film photography, film photography, film blah, 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 cinematography terms, things like, uh, you know, what I, what I mean when I say that, so I say this room is like Dutch angle, basically what the whole thing about this room is, how it's off tilt, it, uh, it's meant to evoke a certain feeling in the uh, viewer, fuck you. Okay, he comes from downtown. <laughs> what are you doing over there, buddy? You feel okay? Do you just really want the duck? Got a block for you. I also don't like whatever that like, screaming monkey thing in the bottom is. It looks like a hollow baby. Like a baby with no face. There's a dark black man. And the ghost from uh, under Undertale. Naps the Blue, I think his name was, like, see, that's him right there. I call Black Holes, The Eye. Go back there with the duck. What's... I'm sorry. Can I go away again, buddy? What's in the dog? It's 
faster than the monkey. What's in the dark? Oh wait. monstrosities what the fuck is this thing supposed to be is it a rabbit is it like an ugly dog ugly dog I'm assuming that, so, what I'm doing here is, uh, on the, oh, I think I heard it when I picked it up. I don't know the x-rays, there's a key inside a bear. So I assume that, you know, see, oh, it's got a metal clink. How do I tear this open? We have to operate. He's got a key in his ass. Oh, a morgue. I like how, you know, my first one was Aqua Morgue. My second was to climb into any and every, uh, you know, open morgue thing I can get my hands into. Ah, I see, I see, I see, I see, I see, I see, I see. Um, no, I do not want to go in there with him. So how's your weekend? God don't. I like how there's still like a, a hand in there. So he's not doing their job cremating all those bodies. Because uh I feel like I might be slightly upset to find out my grandfather had his hand left inside the crematorium.
Let's wait for the horrific monster to make its appearance. I like how old locks are child sized. Perfect for me to get my little fucking grubby fingers on it. Right, because, you know, imagine if it was just like higher up. We were screwed. This is Halloween. child. I don't have uh, the undead fat to uh, give me all the little tips, tips and tricks. So I gotta find it myself. I gotta do it myself. But that's fine. I'm fine either way. I'm not big on backseat, but I think it's okay for little things like that. You know, oh, there's a secret there. You're gonna miss it, you know. Plus, you know, if I'm avoiding an area where a secret would be, yeah, better that I go to that area and then avoid it. Part of me is like expecting like a one of these dolls to, like assemble itself, then try to murder me. Or that that works too. Damn it. Ah, I hate vents. I do I hate disembodied hands attempting to murder me. It's like the, uh, you know, alien. The way it moves.
<laughs> I hate you for that. Oh boy. I feel like it's not dead. Watch for the road. Six, is that you? The fuck are you doing? That's partially right. I was just expecting it to become a full being instead of just a partial being. Petering shot right there. Just a, like a, a three frame skip. Three frame skip. Yeah, just make as much noise as humanly possible, game, please. Corn? Corn? Corn. I like how, you know, of course, they're like me do it by myself. Fuck off. What is the fuck? Green light. Red light. Fuck, 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 fuck. Oh, 
Fuck off, man. Oh, my fucking god. I don't like this. It's not that it's scary, it's just that it's kind of annoying as well. <laughs> What do I do? Where do I go? I gotta figure out while fucking running from spooky boys. back at the beginning. Of course it does. I, I can't, like... The problem is, right, you can't fucking sit there and flashlight them while you're doing this. You have to keep going. Right? So, like, I can't just... Nowhere near me. Nowhere near me. It's just, it's not exactly made for this controller. It's like, I'm using a controller, obviously, because fuck me if I was trying to do this with a. Uh... Look at that. I'm already out of his reach. And I get sucked into his ass. God, I hate fucking running there. What's the point of fucking running segments in horror games? Well, it's... It's so it's spooky, Brandon. Like... <sighs> Moving by the flash I was on it, too. He, he was. He was moving by the flash that was on him. I also gotta have like fucking. I've gotta have like three hands to do this properly. I gotta, I gotta hold down the X button to run. Stupid fucking garbage. I hate horror games. I hate horror games that do this shit. I hate them in general, and what the fuck are running segments? It's a horror game. Shouldn't be about chasing me. Should be about horror. It's not a fucking functional system of turns. It's not exactly easy to turn my fucking camera. But you have to physically face him in order to, you know. At least, you know, give me a secondary respawn point, because it's. each and every fucking time. Like, I have to f fucking face them. what's gonna happen, right? I'm gonna take the fucking fuse out of the door. And then, you know, all the lights are gonna go off, and it's gonna get fucking ten times worse, and, you know. I'm guessing that's the one's alive as well, because he looks, like, meaty in the middle. I just wanna make sure, like, there's not a... So let's say that there's a secret over here. I hate all 
a second. Like the horror games so much. Once a year, I do this garbage. And every year, I regret it. But then, you know. I guess because when I play it myself, I've got shit playing in the background or whatever. Cheese. Wants my cheese. <laughs> I think that cheese has some kind of meaning or whatever. Not meaning, but use. You know, when each pass the time gets every ever so the last word. Oh, he automatically points at them. I'm surprised they're not trying to pull it down. So... Let me guess. I have to turn off the light so he'll get out of the chair. The light has to come back on so he'll get- he'll still freeze. I just need to like turn off while I'm trying to get this going. Right, game? Just to add to that tension. Come on. No. 
stop. I don't want to do this anymore. Like, look how many of them there are. I was pointing the light at him. Why is he still moving? See ya, buddy. Aren't you too cool? Oh, where could they be? Fucking piece of shit. Come on, buddy. Why don't you come over here? And get all three of you in a fucking corner. Is that good enough? Are we all cool here? Are we all having fun in the co in baby time area? Stop. Nope. No. Is that all of you? Oh my god, of course it's not. Of course it's not. Fuck. Oh, this is so annoying. This isn't fun. Like, I, I get like, you know, this game isn't supposed to be fun. It's a fucking horror game. But sitting here managing fucking five mannequins. I can't, you can't manage them all. It's impossible. I, I guess the option is to run through it, right? Because there's just too many of them. Right? Question mark? I don't fucking know. Well, they don't care if there's light or not. And they don't just they just grab me anyway. I'm not gonna break my controller. Like, how the fuck am I supposed to do this? They're faster than me, which is already bullshit. I, I would love a horror game, right? And they don't, you know, obviously, the, you know, what I'm about to say is they don't tell you about it, right? But, like, a horror game where you're basically always inches from being caught, but you can't be caught, right? You know, like, maybe display the character getting caught once. Like, fuck off, man. Look at this fucking... I'm not even an hour in. I'm not even an hour in. I'm already fucking... I'm gonna scream. What is this? I... I mean, I guess I, it's... I guess I'd rather be choosing fight than flight, you know? But what the fuck do I do? I can't corral 17 fucking fully grown adult-sized mannequins into a fucking corner just to fucking play the entire game f walking backwards. Like, fuck. <sighs> like, I'd rather have it be like a scenario of there's just a flickering light going on in here. And like, I get a chance to run away a little bit. This isn't, this isn't like, I, you know, I get this game isn't supposed to be fun. Whatever. Right, it's a horror game. It's not supposed to be fun. You know, fun is just a trigger word or whatever. Blah, 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 blah. But, how is this playable? <laughs> and I'm sure somebody better than me would say, Brandon, you're a fucking idiot. 
you're a loser. And I would agree with both of those statements. And then they would talk about my, my game playing skills. Right? But fuck off, man. Yes, we just included, uh, you know. And I'm out of his reach when he bends over. And I guess, you know, the obvious answer is if, you know, it couldn't just zap me into his hands, they would technically never catch me. But again, right? Let me think that I'm getting away by a breath of my, like, you know, the skin of my teeth. Instead of having to fucking play, like, you know, funny lights with a fucking set of, like, mannequin dolls. It's not, it's no longer scary. You know what I mean? It's no longer scary to me. I'm not, I'm not terrified. I'm not scared. I'm not, you know, I'm no longer missed. Like, you know, you know what I mean? Whatever fucking, uh, and maybe this is just me. Maybe it is just me. But whatever emotion they were going for here is lost. Because I, I no longer feel scared at the fucking, at, at the sequence. I am just angry. I'm, I'm livid. I would like to, uh, have a gun and, uh, possibly shoot myself with it. But, you know, before I do that, I would shoot, like, two or three of these mannequins. See if it fucking does anything. Because, you know, fun. What's such a buzzword, Brad? You can't have fun. Wait, wait, you can't say your game is fun. That's stupid. Like, what am I supposed to do? Run backwards the entire fucking segment? Yeah, your horror music isn't fucking appropriate anymore. They're not scary. They're annoying. So happy you're done with that segment. Nothing brings me more joy. Could you guys stop clitter clattering over there like you're gonna get in? I know you're not. I'm not stupid. You're not gonna get in. And if you do get in, I'm gonna have so many more complaints. Boop. The ball. Can, uh, can I be electrocuted, please? Turn the chair on. Send me to hell. How do I move this? Can I not grab on the sides? No. Oh, there's not even a side bit here. Spooky. No. Oh, you got that one for me? Oh my god, you're allowed to say that. Let me guess. So, when we do this, the lights are going to go off and everybody's going to start running at us. Or we try to get in the elevator. Uh, <laughs> okay. Put it in here. Fine, that one's... Did I really break the game? <sighs> 
If it puts me back in that fucking room, I'm gonna lose. Okay, good. I lose my shit. I would literally, legitimately, I'd probably just, I'd be done for the night. You know, I got, I got my hour in. I've, I've taken my poison. Yes, yes. It's so tasty. Yes, yes. So very good. I'd say, oh boy, I have to do it myself, but, you know, based on how amazingly it went last time. not have more segments in the hospital. Some fat and ghouls. Disembodied hands around here. So how many disembodied hands tend to come to life? Is that just like you know? Is this what Detroit water does to people? You know, when you drink from Flint, Michigan, or whatever. You ain't from Detroit. You never done this before. <laughs> Like fucking, it's like just horrible dark souls in here. When your half fucking orangutan brother in law calls. He's 
It's full of helium. So, I obviously I guess we have to get to that door, right? This is what people imagine when they say gamer gate. <laughs> Ew, don't finger the hole. I wonder if it takes long enough to just build the doll. Wait for him to go back to the other side, just because I feel like it'd be safer to leave when he's on the other side of the room. I'm building my perfect waifu. <laughs> uh, six, you're a little bit outside of the. Jeez, Louise. I'm pretty sure it's Fat Albert. Get a fucking bottle from over there. I think he's white, more or less. So he can't be fat, Albert. See my player? I wish you could see my character, you know? <laughs> It's a very poor angle to be playing from. <sighs> it has to make you wonder again, like I said before, what 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 is going on in this universe? Right, because like, you know, I was told about the what the teacher you know, did. More or less, right, you know. Horrible things, right, but, you know, A, why, which is driven Matt, like, I don't, I just didn't, I didn't go and read the comic or find anything about it. But, you know, was she driven mad by something? Was she just like this to begin with? Like, are they a product of the the world, or is the world a product of them? Before he, you know, tries to waddle back here. There was a key, if you saw, on the top of one of those shelves down there. Which I imagine we're gonna have to get to after calling, walking to the other room. 
I feel like if we fall out, it's A insta death or B insta capture. Which is essentially just insta death ever anyway. There's a lock on that door. Who could have seen that coming? I see. I'm gonna jump in, and then Six is gonna push me through, because I gotta do it by myself again. Understandable in a way, but at the same rate, you know. Maybe, uh... Maybe, uh, maybe we should both be risking our lives, huh? Or do I need to pull her through as well? No. No, I don't think so. How do I get that down from there, I wonder? Just waiting for the loud noise and him to start. Do I want to play a bunch of dead bodies? No. God. In a way, I think I'd choose death. You know what I mean? I can't feel like living in this world would be worth it. Like, right, there, you know, you know, obviously, people like to romanticize a lot of, like, you know, oh, I would love to live in medieval times, you know, I, I could be a king or a knight, you'd probably be a peasant, whatever, but yeah, you know, you could be one of those other two things that, you know, whatever. But, like, you know, people say, oh, you know, what would you do in the zombie apocalypse, or blah, 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 yeah, don't know what yeah is supposed to mean, but you know what I mean. You get the general ideal, the idea of uh, how disingenuous I feel about the entire concept. Um, what I mean is, like, you know, at least in certain worlds, there's a reason to keep going, you know? Like, you, you know, oh, you know, I, I could see myself, you know, living in The Walking Dead. Oh, I would love to, like, you know live in one of these communities that hopefully doesn't go fucking wrong, but realistically, you know, I'm some kind of cult leader, and, uh, maybe I eat people. Just maybe. That's a treat. You know? But then there's words like this, where, like, you know, what's the point? That if you are... So, 
surviving by some merit of the word, you know, is there a point in it? Because, uh, it's so horrific and worthless that, you know. This is, at least he's washing his hands. Proper hygiene, my dude. Dude, it's fucking seal ceiling tiles falling off on his fucking ass crawling over like that. That is not a use of saucer, that's that's unsafe work practices. I'm calling OSHA on your ass. Flatline them. Help me, the numpty. Oh, six, you little bastard! <laughs> that was good. Didn't inform me. Just ran. sense, I guess, but still. And I feel like the player would notice at a certain point, but like maybe once each chapter, right, you make a sequence where the player can get caught. It's not too detrimental, but you know. Just a way to have a horror game that's both horrific, suspenseful, and, you know, fun to play. I feel like it's gonna be is realistically a very hard task, you know what I mean? face now. Get torched, motherfucker! Oh my god, 
at six, please. I guess you know, a moment of respite. It's not very often we get to get be warm. If I can play with a dead body for a couple hours, let's just let the whole place burn down. It's not our problem anymore. <laughs> a secondary large fat man. What happened to my twin brother, Derek? Hospitalized. Click clack. Click clack. I was taking a bath. Bu -bu 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 -bum -bu -bum. I wonder if by killing them we're making the world a better place. Like, obviously they no longer exist, which is a plus. But like, you know. It's like, um... I don't think it's like Persona specifically. I'm trying to think, like, just like... By their existence, it distorts the world. I don't know. Maybe? I don't know. I don't know anything about this game. I don't know the lore. Actually, check back here. That's what the time. I don't want to. Uh, I don't want to miss out a secret. I don't have to. Like, I can't tell which way is the right way. Is it a split story kind of thing? Your choices matter. Horrible butterfly movies, their games. Okay, we're going in the sewer. Okay? I'm putting my foot down. We've dicked around here for a good minute. Enough for the time for the music to stop. Secret was done. I wonder if there's a um, DLC section like there is in the uh, first game, because this is the uh, deluxe version. I did. I spared no expense. I think I don't know. I don't know if there's a step up for deluxe. <sighs> Uh, but you know. If there was a DLC for this game and what it did, I have no clue. It did come out in 2017, so I figured if there would be a DLC for a game like this, it would be out already. 
what I mean. Oh, my favorite channel, Cam. I'm tired. I'm gonna stop a bit early. Cause again, I don't. I just don't know how long this game is, but um, I'll stop a bit early just cause I'm tired for the night and I've done yawning at a screen for an hour and a half. Um, thank you for everyone watching. And do like, on subscribe, follow on Twitch. Maybe we'll just do like, a, we'll do like a segment per night. We do this just to uh, just to you know pad my runtime really, just to really squeeze as much content out of this as possible. I, I'm not that kind of person. Truly, though it might seem like that sometimes, but uh, I'm, I'd like to just take a nap before I have to go to work. So, uh, thank you. <sighs> Sorry. Thank you for watching. Do like, comment, subscribe, follow on Twitch, do all the stuff that helps out, and um, come back tomorrow where we'll be playing more Path of the Righteous, I guess. Because, you know. <laughs> thank you, Unlucky Snatch. <laughs> I like the username. Uh, I can't, I can't tell if it's, uh, it's a bit, it's a bit, it's a bit innuendo-y. I don't know if that was intended or not, and maybe I'm reading into it too much. Sorry, there isn't uh, any display for it. I had a big problem with, uh, bots. Even though I have, like, no followers or anything, so I don't know why they bother with me. Whatever. Uh, I'll see you guys tomorrow. Bye.